beautiful Honolulu, Hawaii. Yours truly, 808 Moto Lifestyles coming at you live and direct. For the latest Moto Vlog. Oh no! Damn, I didn't see that. And unfortunately in Hawaii, the way the systems are set up, there's no way to turn around. Um, I always stop if I see a, a biker on the side of the road. You don't know what the reason is, they may need medical attention, they may even need to, you know, use a phone or something. Just never know, right? Bikers have a unique culture. <laughs> Come from all kinds of backgrounds, all walks of life. All sides of the law, you name it. But a biker is a biker. And there's like a code. Different signs of respect. So that when you see one biker down, you try your best to check on them. Make sure they're good. That's one of the rules to it. It's like I know a lot of people see motorcyclists ride by each other, throw up the universal what's up as they pass each other. Chances are they probably never even saw each other ever and or don't know them. But it's just one of those things. Uh, biker etiquette, if, if you will. <laughs> Unfortunately, at times, it's kind of like for bikers, being on two wheels versus those on four, it's kind of a us versus the cagers kind of a thing sometimes. People don't be paying attention, having no cares in the world, and next thing you know, somebody in your lane. It's like, really? <laughs> I haven't been east in a while, so I'm going east. It's a nice sunny day. And it's Sunday. So, you know, got your Sunday drivers out nonetheless. <laughs> Interesting. But anyway, hope everybody's dealing with what they got to deal with with the new world as we kind of know it and if you haven't already started doing so keeping a mask in your vehicle or in your riding bag or in your helmet or whatever it may be because pretty much any and everywhere you go uh, you gotta have a mask it's a sign of the times Keep that in mind. <laughs> Shoot over to one of the lookout for a little bit, just hang out. Not really doing too much talking today, I'm just enjoying the ride. It's been a very, very long week. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> I am like, yeah, I'm just happy to be off, um, just enjoying being on twos, getting some fresh air while I make my essential rounds, <laughs> yep. One thing I do keep forgetting to do, though, is to, uh, Reset the clock on my uh, odometer. So, I don't really like wearing a watch when I ride. I put anything in my pockets. I don't like wearing anything that protrudes off of my body while riding. Uh, 
just some of the things I've seen in the past. You know, people that ride with their keys in their pocket. That's, you know, that's bad juju. Nobody plans to go down, but uh, in the event that you do, you don't want your keys going into your body, into your skin. Now, avoid that at all costs if possible. So try to find a safe way, safe place to put your keys. Maybe in the bag, fanny pack, I don't care, anything. But yeah, you really don't want them in your pocket. Yeah, bad business. It's a bit windier than I thought it was, but hey, feels good to me. <laughs> Sights and scenes never get old. But I will say this. If you're still taking uh, that plane ride over here to Hawaii, <laughs> let me be clear. Um, State of Hawaii is not playing with that 14 day quarantine. I'm just here to tell you. Oh, I forgot about that. Cruise control. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But yeah, back to what I was saying. Um, Mandatory 14-day quarantine is in effect. Do not get caught slipping. And the crazy thing about it is, most of the people that have been caught up for uh, violating the, the state's government's order uh, is dry snitching, straight telling on themselves. Oh, nobody's going to know. We're just going to hit the sites, go out, get a few photos and videos, and we'll post it to social media. Yeah, you dumb. <laughs> And they've been finding themselves in jail. And I think the bail now is even between 2,000 and 4,000. So you know what happens when you can't bail out of jail? That's right. You stay there until you see a judge. <laughs> and uh, yeah, no thanks. It's not that serious. So if you are coming out here, um, please heed the warnings. As they're really than Holyfield in the real deal holy field <laughs> or you too may be uh subject to arrest just not worth it man i mean seriously it's in effect it's in place for a reason um hawaii is in a unique situation to be furthest away from most civilization i mean the smallest little things that happen in the big city here will automatically get magnified so be respectful and yeah, stay where you are stay home come back another time Hawaii is still on vacation from the vacationers all right and the sooner more people abide by that the sooner things can actually get back to normal and people can actually start coming back here but yeah not fooling around just so you know station wagon up here <laughs> wow that's got to be 80s 80ish <laughs> yeah 
man. You don't see these every day. I want to say Buick or something. Oh, master. <laughs> nice. look good uh, yeah that's the first and I'm just hoping that that helmet was an extra helmet on somebody's bike and it fell off and not that it was an actual uh, head inside of it when it came in contact with the ground I just smelled the buffalo blows I got a quick question for you all out there. What kind of column system are you running, if you're running one at all? Um, I myself use a JBL Pack Top Bolt. <laughs> 